Now, CPUs have multiple numbers, the first one being the number of cores. In the past, a CPU had a single core or a single engine, but now CPUs have multiple cores where each core can focus on one specific task or one specific calculation. This allows CPUs to perform individual tasks more efficiently, or you can combine those cores, if the software allows for it, to perform one task even faster. How fast? you might ask? Well, that's where the second number of a CPU comes into play, and that's the speed or the gigahertz. It's kind of like the horsepower of the car. The higher the number, the more torque and the more power it has, and theoretically, the faster it can go. 